Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Just a quick question about the step on the hull, because we we are very curious to understand why you made the steps on the hull if you had to fly on the water. Well, we use the step of the hulls, so or we, we designed the boat with uh, the step of the hulls to be able to use it as a planing bed as well. So it's not only for uh, the purpose of foiling, but also because we want better air uh, water qualities when we're using the boat. But there are some designs incorporated in this feature that helps us take off out of the water. So that's also why we have the hole that we do. How can you manage the flight system? So we use top-notch software combined with top-notch uh, hardware to detect kind of the space and the, the angle and the uh, position the boat has in the air and how far it is from the water and stuff like that. And then we calculate how far away from perfect balance it is. And with our actuators over 100 times per second, it makes small, small adjustments to change the angle of attack of the foil and move it forwards and backwards in a sense. So it's totally automatic. The pilot doesn't yes. do anything to fly well uh, or to maintain the flight. No, exactly. The only thing you need to do is to accelerate the throttle and take off. Since we're foiling, we need quite a long rudder to come down. Uh, and obviously that's going to be very inconvenient for you if you want to uh, slip the boat on the trailer or if you're going into shallow. 